Hello, I'm Katie. Welcome to the Planner Channel. In this video, we are decorating for the week of June 10th in the Socialite Classic Happy Planner with this pretty, pretty cover and pretty discs. And I think this theme for this week is going to be all student and teacher stickers. Um, let's see, if I get it posted ahead in time, I'll link up here the flip through of the new some of the new student and teacher things. I tried not to go crazy and buy everything, so there's just a few. And But I'm going to use all of them. So I got the stack. Here's all my student and teacher sticker books. I want to do like a summer pink and, well, let me show you, there's a sticker. This I want to be like my inspiration sticker. It's a pineapple and it's pink and yellow. That I want to be kind of my theme for this week. So we're gonna flip through all of these. Well, I'll do it real quick and kind of find the stickers that I think will match that theme for this week. Let me grab my Fiskars cutting mat and take the pages off the discs. Okay, so this is one of the new student books. This is a new teacher book. And then here's another student book. That's all I got from the new collection. I tried not to buy everything. Oh wait, I did get the accessory pack, but I'm gonna save that to go in my new wellness planner. Um, let's see. So I guess all of the rest of these are quote older, older. Oh, this is Bright's. Brights is kind of student. It's kind of like the kids has a lot of like I would call student stickers. So I guess that's why I put Brights in this category. Um, but it's not really a student sticker book. So let's put that aside. I think we have enough. So let's see. These two are student. Oh, this is why because Brights um, looks kind of like goes good with here. Let me show you what I'm saying. Happy Girl is to me like a student book. It has like backpacks and little girl things. And Brights has kind of similar stickers to that. So those kind of go together to me. So we might use some of those. They have a nice bright pink and yellow in there. Here's another teacher book. Here's another teacher book. Let's put the teacher books together. Teacher, no, let's put, okay. We've got teacher books, the new, new stickers. And we've got, these student icons. Okay, we've got student icons. And this, these two are from last year. I guess these are from the year before. And where's the other one? There's a, there's a seasonal. I guess I put the other one with the seasonal. Um, there's another, I have another one, but I think we have enough. All right, so I like to start with washi tape. Let's, let me see if I can find some washi tape that might kind of go with that. Oh my gosh, you guys, look what I found. Pineapples. I didn't even know I had this. So this is, this is a Mambi Happy Planner washi roll. But it's one of the older ones. It's a little thicker. I don't usually use the thick washi anymore because I like this size. This is like my perfect size. But this is so cute. Okay, we're totally using that somewhere. I wanna find those pineapple stickers first so I can kind of figure out, cause this takes up a lot of space, figure out where that's gonna go. And then these are two from Socialite, so we know those are gonna look good. I think both of these are from Glam Girl, and then this is from Trendsetter, I think. But that's a little bit different yellow, although that looks good too. So we'll see once we um, find some stickers, before we put the washi down make sure that it's gonna look right. So let's flip through this, starting with this pink student sticker book. And I have used a lot of these or some of these stickers um, because I like them. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna get stuck flipping through the sticker books again. All right, Katie, focus. There's a good one, yellow and pink. There's a best friends. That's good for, <gasps> live in the sunshine. Okay, I need that. I need like bookmarks. Oh, look at that, Born to Shine. That's pretty. All right, but I'm looking for that pineapple. Of course, I love unicorns. Maybe if I flip through this, oh, there it is. Okay, oh my gosh, it's so cute. All right, look at this sticker. It's shimmery pink foil. Okay, I love that, okay. So that sticker is our theme. Definitely the pineapple washi cuteness. 
Do you, so we might not need other washi if we're gonna use the pineapple washi. This color is kind of purple. It doesn't really look good with that foil color. Maybe we don't need this washi. Maybe we just need this washi. All right, so I definitely wanna put it either down here under that or above it. I'm not sure what other stickers are going up there. See, this thick washi really takes up a lot of space, so if I want one of those big column stickers, I won't be able to use it if I put this up there. But I don't know if I'll find one in our theme. So should we put, where should these pineapples go? This is a regular work week for me, so I will have like my work schedule in here and then things to do after work. So, we could always just put it down here so it's not in the spread. I like it to be in the spread though. Hmm. How about pineapples across the bottom? That's pretty easy. I like these lines that you can line up to um, get your washi placed right. That's why it's really difficult for me to line up with those lines because it's just so light. Oh, where's my thing? Okay. All right, so we've got some pineapples here. And where else? We're gonna go all the way across the bottom and up here or there. Maybe just across the bottom because that's a lot and we're gonna add more pineapples. It's, it's usually easier to just take this washi. You see me do this every, every video. It's easier to just go across here place it down and then trim both ends. I try to fast forward through that usually so it's not so boring to watch. <laughs> it's so it's boring to me. I always fast forward it. Okay. Pineapples, they're so cute. I still feel like we need some over here, but I'm gonna reserve that to see which stickers we put there and we might add more washi later. But we're gonna start off with that pineapples at the bottom. Next is box stickers. Okay, I found some boxes that we can layer. So here's pink and yellow and a green um, over. We need to find some regular boxes like for backgrounds. I think this one Let's see, that black and white's really cool. That's cute, but I don't want to layer over it. So I don't think this one has a lot of background. Um, oh, that one's a cool background. All right, so I need to find backgrounds and then I want to use those. Let's look at this book. This is another student book. Let's see if there are backgrounds in here. Ooh, there's some. There's pink and yellow and orange. Maybe that one. These have pretty boxes too. I love that sticker. Okay. Don't really see more backgrounds. There probably won't be backgrounds in the icons. Let's check out this new, this one's seasonal. I don't think there's any in here. I looked at this one last night. No, there's not that many summer. What is this one? Is this the new student? Oh, this is one of the new student ones. I don't know if there's backgrounds in here either. Oh, those are cute. OK. 
Okay. No, those don't really have boxes. Okay, so we need some boxes. Maybe this, maybe the teacher. Let's see, I think this teacher might have some good background boxes for us. Maybe in the front where, okay, no. See, this one has some good backgrounds, like squares that are background. But I don't see any pink and yellow. That's good, 4th of July. So, so nothing in there. I don't think this one has backgrounds. Maybe. Well, let's check. We checked every other book. These are pretty colors. I like these colors. Oh, that's a cool background. Is this one big? Oh, it's size for the teacher, so it kind of is bigger. Um, okay. Let's go back. So that's a cool background, but we're not doing blue. I like that black and white, but we're not doing black and white. That's a cool background, but we're not doing those colors. Is that it? Oh, I love this chevron thing. Oh, you probably can't even see. I'm just talking to myself. This. One of the bags came in that color. I, I didn't get it, though. I don't have it. Polka dots background. I think that's it. So I like some background boxes. What am I going to use? I just noticed on the front of this book, there's that yellow square. So that's one we can use. Let's just start with that. So we'll just start up here anywhere and place down this box as a background. Oh my gosh, it's totally crooked. You can do a little better than that. Come on. Okay, that's that. So let's layer a pink box over it. Since this has grid lines in it, I don't have to try to get it to line up. I can just line it up with the grid line in there. I can try to. <laughs> okay, so there's one box. Let me try to find another background for some more boxes. Okay, I had to break out the classic seasonal sticker book. I knew there were some good backgrounds in here. And here is a really cute yellow. We'll definitely use that. So let's put that one on this page since we already have a yellow there. Let's put a yellow over here. Something like here. And then uh, I like all of these too. That's kind of red though. It does have pink in it. Maybe we'll use that one, but I'm trying to stick to our pink and yellow theme. Here's a pink one. Perfect. There's also a pineapple one. Okay, so let's put a pink one like down here or yeah, like down here, the bottom. So there's a couple more boxes for us. Let me layer those other boxes I wanted to layer. All right, so we've got pink on yellow background, yellow on pink background. Oh, I should have lined up over here, that grid line. Much better. And then I think we'll go ahead and put another pink on that one. Love it. And then, so we need a little bit more. I like to have a box for every day. So we probably need a couple more boxes. Probably put green here and yellow there. All right, where's my um? Oh my gosh, you guys! I know we're not doing a flamingo theme this week, but I think 
I just love this. We're gonna put this in here. So our background for this one is gonna be flamingos. And that will have a green box. Let's put it kind of to this side instead, just so it fits. Okay, so we need one more here. It's going to get a yellow box, so it needs to be a pink background or maybe a green. I think that's it for the sticker book for backgrounds, summer backgrounds. That blue would look really good too, but I, I don't want to pull in too many colors. Okay, I have to, now I'm on a mission. I have to find one more pink background to go with our yellow box. Okay, I went back to the yellow student sticker book and I'm going to use these stripes. They're almost all pink and yellow, just that one. I mean, some of it's coral pink and then there's an orange, but I like it. And since we'll have the discs and I do have the page dividers, I'll, I still won't have that many patterns on this page and that page at the same time. So, I think I'm gonna switch it around this way though and put it like that, kind of in the middle, it's just random. I like them scattered. It's a little crooked, but whatever. Yellow box. And let's put it off to this side and kind of towards the top. I want it towards the top now. I like those pink stripes. I'm going to make it towards the bottom more. Like that. All right, so let's line this up. Like that. Okay, I like it. We're back to the Sweet Life student sticker book. Um, first of all, I have to have this. Um, what is this called? Clipboard sticker. It's super cute. I just love it. It's going to go on my weekend. Usually Sundays, I'm sometime on the weekend I'm filming. So this will be my to-do list for that. Let's put it, let's put it in the middle up here. It's super cute. Okay. And then I want to use these pineapples as bullet points. I know I did that last week or the week before, but I'm going to do it again. We're going to put one pine pineapple. Let's see, either we'll do two pineapples here and two pineapples here or one each day. I think let's put one each day. So let me get my scissors. Okay, I lost my scissors. Found them. Okay, <laughs> my scissors that are covered with stickers, but that's why I get the um, non-stick scissors because the stickers just come right off easy. Okay, so, well, they don't come off your fingers though. All right, let's get pineapples as bullet points. Oh, where's my tweezers? This will be so much easier. All right. Um, hmm. I guess do I hold the tweezers like that? And then I'm going to trim. So I think we're going to put a pineapple. Hmm. Hmm. What are we doing? Let's put like... Let's do two days that are pineapples. Then I can find some different checklists. So we'll do like Thursday will be pineapples for our bullet points. But let's trim, let's trim it. I like when they're angled and trimmed like this. Like that. And put two. 
two pineapples on Thursday, and then we'll put two on maybe Tuesday. Okay, I wanna make it trim the same, so. This is left-handed. It might not even work. It did work. That's amazing. Okay, so two little pineapples here. And then we'll put two over here on Tuesday. And those will be my bullet points for those two days. And then we'll look for some different checklists to go on the other days. Tweezers really are coming in handy. Let's see, should we do the bottom one first? Let's do that. That's so cute. Okay, I cannot find any checklists in any of these books and that's probably probably because, oh wait, here's this one. I might be able to use some of those, but I don't really get the, that, that would be the teacher books and the student books that are functional. And I just like the fun stickers kind of more. So those functional books have more of the checklists and that kind of stuff. But I did find another clipboard. So now we have a clipboard on this page. Let's put a clipboard on this page too, somewhere. I know they're both yellow. It's kind of a lot to put. Let's put it like here. So that will be my checklist for Monday. And so I've got one on Monday and Sunday. And we've got some pineapple bullet points. So let's see, we've got, a, we've got this, those bullet points, these bullet points. So these two days still need some kind of checklist or something. Um, this is too boxy and too big. Same with those. But I think I'm gonna go ahead and put in the decorative stickers and then figure out, we'll probably, I mean, we'll definitely have some bullet points or some checklists we can throw in there at the end after we'll go ahead and decorate because that's the fun part. So let me get that pineapple sticker that I want right here and let's figure out where that's going. I did find another sticker from the wrong wrong sticker book that I want to put in. I think it'll go on the weekend. Oh my gosh, look at that. Okay, so where is this going? Should it be, I usually put a quote over here. We could go there. We could erase those bows. Oh, I really like it here. All right, let's cover up those bows with the, oh my gosh, this stuck to my microphone. All right, let's put it back for a second. And then we'll put the pineapple over here in this corner. So let's just cover up these bows with the mono correction tape from Tombow. There. Maybe the lines too, a little bit. I don't know how wide it is. Okay. Oh, it's really tall. So, do we want it to completely go off the page? Okay, I need a little more space to do this. I don't wanna cover up the word vibes. I don't wanna go completely off the page. So I think right about there should do it. It's so cute. So we'll need to trim off this little clear edge.
I love that. I kind of now want to put pineapples on this side too. Okay, let's look at some of these new sticker books. See, there's a sunshine sticker. There's a yellow bar. Seize this day, that's pink and yellow. There's a yellow, what does it say? Wake and caffeinate. I like that. That's kind of sweet. We're kind of doing a little bit brighter pink and yellow. These are a little bit muted. There's our colors in a rainbow, I like that. All right, pink, pink and yellow, pink and yellow. Me time, holidays. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. The sparkles. You know what, I wanna use the sparkle letters from, I think there's some in here too. Where are those? Are they in this book? In one of these books. I don't see them now. I found them. They're in the purple student. That's the same matching pink. See, these are a little bit red. I like that idea, but let's use the matching color that matches this palm sticker. And I like to put, see if I didn't use them all up. Did you find them? I like to do this sometimes, which I'm going to do this week. I like to put the letters. Come on. T. Should I go up here? No, I like it on here. T. G. I like them kind of squiggly. I don't know. Not even, I like them uneven, T-G-I-F. Cute. Okay, this sticker book, The Purple Student, also has some checklists. So here's one we can use. Here's pink. Let's figure out where that can go. I don't see a yellow one. Maybe we'll have to do a green one. Let's see, that could go here or here. I think I like it here. Oh, well, yeah, let's just use the green one. Unless there is a yellow one in here somewhere. Let's just look real quick. And we'll use the green one if we can't find yellow. Oh, there's some pink. It's yellow, but it has like an orange or red kind of color on it. Oh, here's some checklists, but again, it's yellow, but it's not like the right shade. Yeah, we'll just use these back here. All right, because there's a green, there's a pink. Let's put, let's put pink here and green over there. Go to the bottom, let's put it here. It's easier with the Sometimes we go grocery shopping Friday night, so if we do, that will be on this list. Hmm, I don't really like the green one there. It's not the right color. It's a different color, green. 
I don't like it. Hmm. Because this is like light green and dark green, and that's the same. This is like a different color. It doesn't look good. Oh shoot. Hold up some paper. Take that back. Maybe we'll try to find a yellow checklist. Oh, we're getting closer. We got one pink one. All right, so let's find some more pineapples and decorative stickers. Right, there is one from the seasonal wrong wrong sticker book that I want to use. This one, Live in the Sunshine. It's a box sticker. Where is this going to go? Oh, maybe this could go in this corner to cover that up. I don't know if I like it like that. I kind of like it like this better. Or it can go on my Saturday. Or it can go down here. I kind of like it here better. I'm putting it here. That's a lot of boxes this week. Boxes on every day. Maybe next week we won't do it boxes. Okay, I think I'm going to do a palm leaf and a pineapple to cover up those two bows down there on the left corner. Here's the palm leaves. And then I found another pineapple here. It's kind of small. So maybe, so first of all, let's erase these bows. Can you see? Okay. Erase the bows. I'm sure I could cover this up better if I wasn't so trying to go so fast. If you're careful, you can get it perfect. Okay. All right, so I'm thinking like, oh, here's like a little collection of palms. Those would also look really good. Do we like the black and white or do we just want green? Those are really big though. We don't need that many. I just thought it'd be cute to have like one palm leaf, and a pineapple. So let's do it. Do you guys struggle with getting the stickers off the page? <laughs> I do. All right, if we put that there, now that I've scribbled over everything, I will need two palm leaves. Let's see. Do I want to overlap them like this, this, or like that? Oh, that looks good. Okay, I do like that. Let me see if this will cover up enough. Maybe I need a bigger one. Or is that one bigger? Is this one bigger? Same, same. Oh, so if I do it like this, That will look cute and we'll cover everything. Okay, I think that's how it's gonna go. All right, that's a little, that's different. <laughs> I like it though, it goes, kinda goes. Okay, I just saw these little flags in the new blue student sticker book and they're really cute. Let's use those along the top because we don't have anything up there. Let's get tweezers. Look at this, ugh. It's perfect for Monday. Monday gets an uh. Should I go here, 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 like there? Oh, okay, a little crooked. I kind of like it. All right, let's. There's some other ones too, like busy day. I mean, every day is a busy day for me. Um, but I want to put. We can put a green one in there. 
let's put them kind of different places. How about on the boxes? Oh, I like them on the boxes. Well, that one's pink. Should we do this yellow on yellow? That's cute. And then green on the green one. Real life. I don't know where this should go. I like it like that. All right, are there any more? We don't have anything for this side. I mean, they don't have to be the same. Oh, more coffee. Okay, here's one more. More coffee on Friday. I like that. And then there is a pink one here today. I guess we'll use that. It's light pink, but that's okay. All right, this spread is, I like this. First of all, I love these colors. I love these quotes. This is the new purple student sticker book. And they say, have some fun. I like this live in the sunshine. I think I want it to say have some fun also. All right, do we want pink or yellow? I think it's gonna go something like this. Isn't that cute? I like that. I like this sticker right here. I think that should go on my little Friday night. It's like yellow and green and it looks good with these pineapples. Let's put it right there. Oops, come on. I like that, that's cute. Okay, let's see if there's any more in here. There's my unicorns. I don't want rainbows, no cherries. <gasps> Look at this, that is so cute. It's little pineapples and a little pink washi strip. That's going up here on my weekend. Yes, that is super cute. And then it needs something on it. I don't know what that is, like some words. We need a quote to put on that. They love that. That is super cute. Okay, what else is in here? That might be my, <laughs> I like this sticker and that sticker the best so far. Oh, these are pretty. I think I've said that every time I've seen that page. There's some more letters. Those match too, I could have used those. This could be my quote for over here. I think it is. That's my quote. Should it, oh, oh should I layer it on that stuff? Or move it up here? I'm gonna layer it on that sticker. Just a little bit. All right, I have a lot of stickers. I still, like, I usually put my little work schedule up here, so I kind of still need something, um, like a bullet point up there. Oh, maybe we should put this weekend vibes on that. It's clear. Or that one, but that one's kind of big. Let's use this one. Oh, come on. No, I do that every time. Should it go on top of it? Kind of like it below it. Then that line goes right through the pineapples. Is that just how it's gonna look? 
still kind of like it. Like this. Oh. No. All right. Maybe it is going. Oh, man. I think I messed it up. Let's go right on top. Hope you can still read it. And you can't see my pineapples. It's super cute though. I still like it. All right, do we like these notes enough? Maybe. Let's go with a maybe. These are pretty. There's more notes. Oh, I need that, don't stress. Let's put that in there somewhere. Wednesday night. That's when I need that, I think. Okay. Let's see, there's to-do flags. Those would work. Let's put green. Let's put green. Oh, broke it already. Okay, let's put green here. Oh, I like it like sideways like that. Green, I think I want it yellow on Friday. Let's do that. Yellow, let's put pink here. This pink here. And all right, one's silver and one's pink. <laughs> I cannot get it off of this page. All right, got it. All right, this is either going it could go there. Is that squeezed in there? Maybe I won't put one on Tuesday? Or do I move them over? Put a pink one here and a silver there. You know what? I really like that. It'll just be... Oops. The corner is all mushed up. Probably make it worse trying to fix it. Let's see. Let me fix it. There we go. Oh, all right, it's just mushed. I couldn't fix it. I don't like it there. I don't like it there. Well, it's not that bad here. I'm gonna put it here. Okay, maybe I'm crazy, but I can't find another checklist. I'm just gonna put this one back on, the one I took off. It really is not the right color. Ugh. but it does need a green checklist here. So it's gonna be not the right color and it's gonna go here anyway. So place that back down. I'll cover up where I messed up anyway. And we just have a slightly off color green checklist here. I think we're done. I think I'm all set. These are cute. This is cute. I like this week. Subscribe to learn how to use your daily planner to get organized, stay focused on your goals, and create a powerful plan for your life. Click the link in the description to download your free power plan checklist. If you like this video, be sure to subscribe, share with your friends, and hit that thumbs up button. See you in the next video.